Hello friends, I am Arun Vadera. We all love to communicate. Freedom of expression is indeed very important and our fundamental right. As it is said, ability to communicate is God's gift to living beings. All earthly creatures, namely humans, flora and fauna, and even the elements of nature, communicate with each other in their own way. Somehow the phenomena is unique when we talk of human beings. They alone are endowed with a supreme power called the human brain. The human brain can not only think and feel but is able to verbalize thoughts and feelings which get further communicated through the spoken or written form in words. It is relevant here to get acquainted with the various forms or types of communication. Communication can be non-verbal or verbal. It can be informal that is personal with family members or friends. It can be formal that is official or commercial. You will not address and talk to your boss in the same manner like you would do with your friends or your siblings. Nonverbal Nonverbal communication, that is the body language, consists of voluntary or involuntary movements of our body parts right from the head to toe. Our appearance in general, including the way we stand, sit, hold or carry ourselves, tells a lot to the other person. Our facial expressions, such as a look of fear, anger, delight, dejection or excitement, all are powerful indicators of the thoughts crossing our mind. You sometimes might say that you did not say a harsh word, but your expression would reveal your inner thoughts to the recipient of those thoughts. Gestures It means movement of our hands and limbs and that conveys innumerable messages. We consciously or unconsciously use our hands a lot to express ourselves. We enforce, emphasize and explain using our limbs. Using an index finger to indicate, admonish or to warn is the most common example. Sign language. You all can remember the dumb charade games you played wherein one partner communicates through gestures and sign language and the other has to interpret say a film's or a song's title. Sign language originated as the first tool of communication in the prehistoric period. This developed as a powerful medium of communication amongst the deaf and dumb. The scientifically formulated system of communication is highly effective and is universally recognized. Mannerisms All kind of physical mannerisms, natural or cultivated, also form a part of our body language. Unwarranted shrug of shoulders, excessive use of hands while talking or contorting one's features can at some times damage communication by sending wrong signals. Worst amongst these is aping others. Public speakers and political leaders have to pay a special attention lest they are misinterpreted. They even hire teachers and coaches to guide them. Verbal communication. Human beings love to talk and verbalize their thoughts. From sign language to words, 
is the most amazing journey of mankind. The progress of civilization happened on the wheels of communication. In other words, communication and civilization are so integral to each other that one is imaginable without the other. Sounds developed into words and language was born. Knowledge traveled through space and time via speech and written form and the journey continued. Verbal expression is the most exclusive privilege of human species. Only man can speak words. All other creatures only produce sounds. Gradually a system of phonetic symbols was developed for humans. Spoken symbol acquired written form called alphabet. Thus language so far only spoken could also be written. The written form of language is called script. Conclusion Communication is power. It is the lifeblood coursing through the veins of civilization. All its forms, nonverbal, verbal, spoken or written, need to be nurtured as skills that need constant honing. Very few are lucky enough to be born with innate communication skills. Rest all have to keep learning as they proceed along life. The best thing about communication is that it can be cultivated through education and practice. Only the effort must be constant and sincere. Best wishes.